Okay. Back. I was about to say, I can't believe it took two hours for that one fight. But it was two. There was two fights. And I made bad choices in both of them. And yet... Uh... We did it? So... Oh, okay, I remember this, yeah. I'm still weirded out by that one that one event at the beginning of the game that was like an actual cutscene that was in the Warren Report, but we never actually saw it. It's so like the only reason I would have seen it is by looking in the Warren Report, so now I'm just like... It had to do with someone's death. Yeah, it was Ravnus's death, and it's just like... That cousin just never happened, she was dead. And I was like, wait, what? So... I haven't really progressed much story-wise lately. It's because I spend so much time in the Wildwood. Uh, defeated General. Oh yeah, these are cutscenes, not like extra bits. The talk is the extra bits. Peace still eludes Krutanai. Poor Krutanai. Oh yeah, I was like, who the fuck is Volak? You saw him in that cutscene. Alright, he fleed from Brigantis. Cressa wants vengeance. Understandably, Zabos is dead. Moldova is dead. Mr. Hector. Oh! Went to Moldova, and then we killed him at that place. Right? He scored a crest at break and just cast it safely. It was in Kill Bay Order Bromelot. Okay. Uh, Cassandra is dead. <laughs> that whole family is dead. Because of me. Uh, he did. He was a budding astrologist, apparently. Or astronomer. I am untarnished. Let's say that. That is my title. Enemy slain 391, mostly Galgastan. 103 unknown. I, I guess, there's lots of beasts, I guess. Beasts are all unknown. I've used the chariot 26 times. It doesn't feel that high. Zero allies slain. And I intend to have zero allies slain until the end of the game. Uh, no one levels and no one learned anything. But let's look at my new beast. For some reason, I always want. Oops. I always want to have two of each for some reason, but it's really not necessary. Okay, I keep, like, pressing left to go back, but that don't work. Sure, 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 sure. Cruelest cut. A short range attack with just slashing damage. Single target is just one. Chance to stun. Okay, granite fist. Okay, this is the blue helmet golem as opposed to the gray hel helmet golem. I don't know what the difference is. Raven Eye. I guarantee when I use Raven Eye, it's not going to do nearly enough. <laughs> nearly as much damage. Uh, which, hold on, which stat did the most for specials? Because those are considered specials. Oh, that's mind. Success of special skills and offensive and defense and magic. Was this the success of special skills? I 
I guess mind is what you need to like afflict statuses to people, which is why certain characters they have those spells at disposal, but they just fucking can't. Uh, increase my aura by one rank until next attack turn. What is what does the level of Rampart of War even do? Does it make it bigger? Don't actually know. Gordian Lock is bullshit. <laughs> so she gave me how often it was going off. Crushing, crushing, crushing. I mean, I'm good. I'm good with what they have. I assume they don't cast spells. Uh, they don't have any like. They just hit with their fists. So that's cool. Um, I wonder what the difference is between stone and clay. I mean, I can't just go back and forth. I have plenty of marks. They have the exact same abilities. Are they just a weaker version? Because this is just this higher damage, period. I'm just gonna assume it's a weaker version, so I'm not gonna go out of my way to have a clay golem as well. Uh, yeah, Cyclops or Cyclops. Period. End of story. Let's see. Attack. All the usuals. Immunity to rampart. The move is reduced by one in general. Sweaty palms. Reeking meatballs. Chance to flick misstep. Chance to let in and hobble. I don't know what let in does if hobble reduces your movement. Maybe let in makes you reduce your jump. Misstep. I don't know what that would be. Stun enemy units within two tiles. And glare. Hobble enemy units within one tile. I don't know what about howl on. Howl and glare. I mean, one does let it hobble a misstep. Let's go with Reeking Meatballs. Uh, and they can cast all kinds of spells, although they're Thunder, so it's like, I would just have Thunder stuff. I could just give them the level ones, unless they can do any. Oh, they Is mine super low, though? Uh, oh, Spell Charge would be a good one. Paradigm shift. Just like supporty ones. Just because I don't think it's... It, the chances of me inflicting any statuses on an enemy is going to be mega low. Okay, mending seed. Magic leaf. Just a ha hollow... Oh, the better... It's a better revive stone. I see 10% HP MP. What does this say for res? Sacrifice HP to heal nearby friendly units. I mean, if anybody's gonna sacrifice HP, it's gonna be a fucking beast. What does it say for Resurrect? Also, what can you not get? Oh. Mind Leaf plus two. I don't have a lot of plus twos, I guess. Uh, where is... 
Oh, and this one's 25. I see. I was wondering why I would ever want to increase my max MP, because it didn't seem to matter, but, like, if you're rising, the more MP you have, the more MP you get up with, so... That could be the reason. Uh, some people still have, like... Regular mend leaves, and regular mend leaves are complete garbage now. Switch out to mending seed. He doesn't even have a res item, that's insane. Halloween stone. I keep saying Halloween stone. It's a Halloween stone. Flip stagger. Did misstep, I suppose. It was just healing, right? Yeah, it's just healing. I wish I could say what Rampart Aura 1, the difference was, because I don't remember what the difference between Rampart Aura 1 and 2. Uh, I have a lot of people who don't have any items equipped. The damage for this, uh, defined? Right to Pondus. What's the sand burst? Range seven. I'm guessing this is just a better. Mysterious energy emanates from this orb of Earth Crystallos. To me, this is just a better, like, one of these. I don't know. I guess he can have one. Uh, he'll have a bomb. Uh, just remove. Still, I don't know. Just have something. Paul should have at least a plus one. Blessing stone. You're healers. You don't necessarily need leaves, but I guess I should. You have nothing. I don't know if you need a magic leaf. Fruit. Blessing stone. Poison. I don't know. I don't know what sidestep does, but have it. <laughs> uh, spoil heal, sure. I don't. I don't know that what foul weather does. I still don't. It said all. I, all, all it said was uh, weather affects the battlefield in mysterious ways. How it does that, I have no idea. I don't know that I never gave items to any of my dragons. I guess I never bothered to even, like... Like, use items with my dragons. Do I have any more meads? I don't have any more meads. Feeble's good. Because why not? Alright, as long as people have items. Okay, and it was Mendley plus two. Mendley plus two. I swear people had, like, regular Mend leaves. But I scrolled through this and no one had. I guess except for some of my big beasts now, but. Whatever. Good day. If there's new, like, a tier of equipment, I'm kind of screwed money-wise. There's a new tier of equipment. Ah! This, this is, this is bad. I can't afford any of it. I spent all of my money giving everyone, like, upgraded stuff. I 
I mean, not for not for everything. Not for everything, just some melee weapons and shields. Uh, is there any? I mean, I bought at least one of everything, so if I see any zeros, okay, I have everything here. Buy some of those. I need a bunch of those. Because only healing 150 is really bad now. So it might be it might be worth just going straight to mending self, so how much HP do we have on average? Uh the lowest I see is six hundred. <clears throat> I mean it's particularly valuable on, you know, all the beasts and stuff. A lot of people have like seven, eight hundred HP. It's just like the casters that don't. So like for them, mending seeds are great. Uh, for, for everyone else, I mean, this is double. It's double the cost. I'll, I'll end up switching to mending selves relatively soon, I think. Maybe I should just get I'll get ten and have. I'll give them to my beasts because they would. They would really. Uh, they would really benefit from something like that. Uh, some more blessing stones. I can't buy the better stones because I've, I've just been looting those. I would like more of these because breach is really good. Of those for sword masters. And that's just materials. Any new codexes? No? Alright then. This is still all the default stuff. Right. Items restocked. Hell yeah. Let's go. Oh. Use magic to remove a debuff. What if I don't get a debuff? I should look at what the reward is and see if I need, like, need to like try and go out of my way. Who this? Oh! Wait. No, I don't recognize this guy. He's a sword master, though, and they're really good. I guarantee stat-wise, he's just better than mine. Yeah, he's just better than mine. Anyway, he is three levels higher, but like... I'm seeing some 80s and stuff in here, even if, if, if Pal was level 22. No. He's just straight up better than Powell. It looks like he's a new dance, too. Fortifies. I assume that's a defensive one. And he's already level 21. It's Katana. Uh, that kind of looks like Nybeth, but isn't. Sorcerer. Rogue? This is new? I don't know if that's unique or not. What are the chances I could convince her to join my team? Guards you with eyes cold and distant. Probably very low. I could try, though. Not openly discontent. I mean, he's more amenable to being recruited than she is. 
Although I might just get rogue marks and be able to just like have my own without trying to recruit. He's just a cleric. I always get confused because Dinalto looks like his portrait makes him look like a default cleric. So I keep thinking Donalto's face is the default cleric, but it's not. Uh, I assume my main goal is to save this guy. I don't really have any knights. It said bring an archer, right? So I guess... That would be good. Well, it gives me resistance charms. I mean, those are stats. Stats are good. Magic to remove a debuff. Sleep and charm. Or just ease. Who is ease? Gurland has ease. I mean, I'll just bring Gurland. Where you at? Gurland. Good. Instead of Sistina, bring Nicolina. Benedict. Aristotle has to stay. This sounds good to me. Yeah. After him. I do need another Beastmaster though, because then I can just have like a full beast team where I have a couple of Beastmasters with all these beasts and dragons. I feel like they would be weaker though, like they're tanky, but they don't do, do they're not capable of nearly as much damage as human characters are so far. Huh? They move like the wind. That man. Whoever he is, he's in trouble. Denim of Goliath! Our mysterious swordsman has flushed out rare game! The wheel turns for us! Right, I need to move quick. Make sure... His name is Brantis. Make sure he doesn't die. Do I get MP for shooting trees? I don't. It is just kind of raising my RT when I do that, I guess. I should probably not. Tree in my way, it is. God damn it. I'm shooting it anyway. Man, I've gotten zero meditates. That's bad, man. Oh, I wish, I wish fucking sword masters could. That'd be nice. This way, we can help you. And you are. Uh... My name is Denim Pavel. I fight for this land's future. Young for a knight, Captain. No matter. I'll take what help is offered. Hey, 
Hey, he's not he's not stupid. Like my sister. <laughs> Who's a healer and runs at the enemy. I still regret giving her attack spell. She started fucking just not healing my party. When I really needed her to heal the party. Cleric's gonna have Boon of Swiftness or some other like bopping spell. Okay, reach. Granted, they're not getting their meditates off, but like if they could just like cast a spell on an ally, that would be pretty handy. While we're like waiting on all this stuff. Fuck that tree. This is a good time for ease, actually. I can totally get my uh, thing off next turn, at least. This tree is going to be in my way. Don't mind if I do, crit card. Um, I do want to attack, though. Get in front of a uh, Benedict for the magic. Well, hopefully, he gets a meditate off so he can just AoE spell them. Yeah, what is Sarah's mind? 85. The so things like sleep and paralytic wave just have like 0% yeah, chance of ever working. I think a Terra Knight that's been raised as a, a high resistance character, or a high mind character, like a cleric, uh, would work pretty well. Or just any Terra Knight that's like, I think that would, that would work pretty well actually, just in general. Just a more magically focused Terra Knight would be cool. Instead of like a knightly Terra Knight. Or do I want to just surround her? No, I want to grab this. I can't just hit a fuck ton. Nice. He's still stunned too. No buffs and like other things. I didn't even check to see what level these people are. They're all 22. Meditates. One forty four, one eighty one. It's 
a shame I didn't get Mother's Blessing. That would have been nice. Um, they definitely do magic. Well, let's make sure I silence you. I'm so glad I grabbed that crit card. Um, he's good here. We're kind of trapped in here now. I think this 42. She still just does fuck all the people. Unless they're a mage and a healer. There's a bunch of physical cards over there. And that's her, I'm gonna have her head towards those. Man, they're just rotating on him. God damn. I can't get I can I can have Sarah go in and like attack this one, but I wanna have like I'd rather Sarah stand where Cannabis is standing, but I can't I can't be helped. Not right now. Nice, but you're gonna you're gonna ease cannabis here. I uh, can't get in range to hit anybody, so we're gonna strengthen. Freddy has the fucking the breach. I can't get in range to actually hit somebody. 79. I'd rather save for Rending Gale. That generally does more damage. Uh, let's just grab this grid. Head towards the magic people. Stumbling. 260, 290. You're lower though. Do that, and then you gotta run. Um, we gotta run. I wanna save those cards for Aerosol when she gets there, so you just go. Here. Hope that they don't take those cards. Oh, she doesn't have heal too. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, we are clumped up for big spells. Man, that archer's going deep. Where is my, where are my meditates? Like, come the fuck on. Man, that ninja does a lot of damage.
Hey, I'm in range. I actually hurt somebody. I can actually hit somebody with, uh, with my spear. So I'm just gonna heal and get into position. It's up here. Oh. I don't want a sand spider. I can hit. I can potentially hit three people. I could also just grab this magic card first. And it might crit, so. Nice. Two sixty-four. A regular a regular crit would do more. His hit sky range isn't really very good. Really not. Do I want him to run forward? Hmm. He's in a good spot for a major heal, although I'd rather I'd like to grab this. Grab this. No! I was gonna have Redwall do grab that card. I really hope Redwall gets a Berserk though, because it would be huge. Five. I think a Rending Gale almost kills him. It's a really small chance of something crit critting, so I'm gonna go for it. Dang. Uh, no Berserk either. Not unfortunate. Run back in. Grab that physical. And he's kind of at the mercy of all these mages. I could just shoot them from up here. That's a lot of damage. I don't know where that extra 94 came from. Always oh, like. Oh, he's air instilled. Never mind. Makes sense. Really wish he had heal too. I don't... Kind of unfortunate. Kind of just walked into our archer range, didn't I? I prefer him curing an ease than actually healing anybody. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if I can reach. I can't reach from here. Having two healers is the way to go. Oh. 
was debating on whether to run in front of her to block or to just go up, go on her side. Stripling who betrayed the resistance. All that talk of heroes go to your head, did it? The Duke favored you above all others. But like any mongrel, you were quick to bite the hand that feeds. I fought not for the glory of a single man. I fought to bring peace to my people, to Valeria. It is the Duke who betrayed our struggle. <laughs> Listen to him crow! Steady hands, lads! We face a foe more foul than the Hierophant himself! Ow. I know he's the boss character in here, but ow. Shooting the healer is what they do. Redwall gets targeted pretty hard all the time. I might just grab that resistance card for him. He does have low resistance. I'm gonna do that. I'll attack the healer. Run. Actually, hold on. I'm not sure I know what misstep does. Oh, it's the range avoidance. I thought it was like, maybe you like, have a chance to not move when you want to move. It was what, like 87 or something? It was either 87 or 89, but... I kinda hope it was 87, because that means I got three resistance out of that card. Which is pretty good! Ooh, another one! MP card. I don't want to. I kind of want to have a uh, Benedict grab that if, if you can. Um, here for a major heal. Was in still air will kill him. Oh, it's not range. Okay. I'm gonna choose a ground that's not has a value of 30 instead of 15. Should I run right up? Just get that auto? I should. I was immune to fear. Oh, it's a shame. Shame I can't reach. I mean, the only one I can reach is the boss. I can't actually hit him. <laughs> well, I guess I can target someone else. Alright, 
now I'm just kind of... I'm just delaying until I kill the other two for maximum, maximum gains. Oh, it's 35. I mean, you can do a ton of damage to us. So, if I can silence him, that would probably be good. Also, I can I can undo most of his damage. So, five hundred. My God. Wants to kill Redwald and no one else. Can I reach? Let's go kind of far over. Should be able to reach from here. Yeah. Alright, it's better than being three levels up. This went pretty well. And everyone's healthy. I'll get out of a melee range. Two healers is the way to go. I should I should do less than that in the future. And then having a few others with the option to heal if, if I need them to. It's just, it's just it's too good. From above with this angle. Oh, I can. 14. 264. Go oh, fuck yourself. Uh, failed by a traitor. Forgive me, my duke. And the person I was trying to save didn't fall over. Thank you for aiding me. You're the one they call the Hero of Goliath. Which happened in every other one, and it just made me wonder if that is the reason why they didn't join me. It's like, well, they didn't die, but they did get injured, and so you're not good. It's, that's not good enough. I'd rather you address me by my name, Denim Pavel. Of course, forgive me. I am Hoberim Vandam. I owe you my life. I'll not forget it. What errand brings you to such a place as this? I heard you were bringing the fight to the Dark Knights. I thought to lend you my sword. You've some score to settle with the Dark Knights? Aye, you might say that. What if I told you it was they who stole the light from me? <sighs> I may not be able to see, but my sword is truer than most. Let me join your struggle. Let's do it. You would be a welcome addition. You've my thanks then, and my sword. I also get the feeling because this is this game was made in an age where it's like if you want certain people that you can acquire later on, you have to say no to some of the other people earlier. This is definitely the kind of game where it's like you can't have everybody. If you want to just take the first people that come along, great, but you can't have everybody. A lot of XP. I kind of wanted to see it go up, but I, I got impatient and hit the button. Everyone gained two levels. <laughs> but not one fight. I guess that's all the all the banked I had. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. It's mostly weapon skills. Uh, cannabis stuff upgraded. Sarah's stuff upgraded. The only one I'm sure of is full Kurtz. I'm not sure what that is, so I have to take a look. Three Kurtz. I am told Tartaros has accepted our proposal. He has. We're to meet at the cathedral in Rhyme at a time of our choosing. He even agreed to limit our escorts to three men apiece. 
<laughs> You've served me well in this vice. I could ask for no finer envoy. We are one step nearer to vanquishing the Bakram. All well and good, Your Grace. But can the Dark Knights be trusted? I should have your tongue out for that. You dare question me. You squabble like children. Your concern, however well meant, is uncalled for. The Dark Knights will honor their agreement. They know full well the Bakram cannot stand against us with the Golgastani gone. An alliance serves their interest as much as ours. If the Commons learn of this pact with the Dark Knights, it will not go well for us. We need only maintain the deception until Branton falls. His claim to power rests on the young heir to House Eltenehu. Without the boy, Branton is nothing. Stripping him of the Regency will be simple enough. With his power lost, his flock will soon scatter. Once we have restored peace to the Isles, the Dark Knights will have no choice but to return to Lodis. <laughs> I know you've only just returned, but I'm afraid there's no time to rest. We must inform Tartaros of the time of the meeting. Fetch me quill and parchment! I'm still, I'm, I'm getting more and more curious about how things would change if, uh, we had gone along with it and we were still working for the Duke. Alright, I'm gonna miss Powell, because I'm basically never gonna use him again, because it's like... Every single stat. Then now only now there's only a one level difference. Every he has ten more strength, like eleven more dex, uh, twelve more agility, and like twelve more resistance. His attack. What do they have? He has a he has a worse weapon, and yet has a higher attack. And has higher defenses and more HP, and it's just, it's, he just, he just has, and he doesn't even have upgraded equipment either, and his defense is higher, and it's just, it's, this is nuts. And he's already level 21, so he has Stone Bloom. Hope is does more damage than like Skyrim. Skyrim is not worth it compared to the fall falling blade. But yeah, I mean, I mean, if I want two, I guess if I want two swordmasters, I have the option. I haven't even tried, but I assume I can change his class if I want. I can. I didn't get any, uh, like, rogue marks, though, which is unfortunate. I could always just turn Powell into a rogue. <clears throat> I assume they want dex, and he already has high dex, so... I mean, it's either dex or agility for them. Agility affects anything else because I feel like I feel like a ninja with high dex would do a lot more damage. It's melee, physical attack, melee attack. Actually, yeah, I just, I don't know how it works. Like, they got high agility, but like, is that... If it's just accuracy and nothing else... High, like, I don't know. 
really want mega high agility. I don't know. I don't know. Um, oh, wait. And then, um, Fulker got a thing. Was it just upgraded Phalanx? No, it was something else. Guardian Force. Redirect 50% of damage taken by, by friendly units to target unit. It is an auto, though. Then two tiles. That'd be really handy to have, like, a knight with this on and have them just hang around near the healers and the mages. So that when they're constantly getting shot by archers, uh, they take half damage in full cart. I assume, I assume it's, um... Well, I would hope that, like, let's say... My healer was going to take 100 damage, and this was on. The healer takes 50. And Fulkert, I would hope instead of him taking 50, he then just takes half the damage if they would have attacked him. So he takes, like, two. Uh, so that could be good. I could have, um, I have, I have Voltaire. I gotta have Voltaire specialize in that. When he gets it. Well, I don't know, who has higher... I don't know, I don't know. Well, you know what? We'll figure this out later, because I am gonna end for now. Because I want to try and, uh, have a snack. I shouldn't eat at all, but I haven't eaten much today in general, so I want to have a snack and stuff. Before it gets too late. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed your time here, feel free to follow if you've not done so already, but until next time, thanks for hanging out.